okay so this video is about how we can share our teachable courses with our students and how students can log into the to the that courses okay so the course will be shared by the uh, instructor or teacher or maybe by admin okay so how we can share that like uh, how students will know that I have to log into this course so there are uh, two mechanisms so I will show you so first of all you have to log into your teachable account if you are an admin and you have created a course on teachable so when you will log in you will see all your schools list be listed here so I have created a school name as 1TV6 training so when I will click on it uh, I will be redirected to the admin page where I can add some stuff to my course so in my uh, course I can see all my courses by in the course sections here so in this section as you can see at the end uh, I just want to share my this course with my students trend micro and point security with epic one so what I will do I will click on this course and here as you can see that uh, my course is open and I can add I can edit and I can do anything with my course if I want to update it I want to add something and anything but our agenda of this uh, video is that how we can share this course with our students so that they can access that now uh, as you can see here about this this is the URL of our course but this is for admin but we want to share a course in the link that a student can uh, go through and they can log into that course because if I share this link uh, it will not be work for students because this is for admin so what I need to do I will click on preview button here after after opening my course or in teachable uh, what I need to do I need to click on preview button here so I will see two options uh, either I want to uh, sh uh, see my sales page or course curriculum so actually I have two options to share a link with the students so I will show you both first I will show you how you can share your course by sales page so just click on the sales page and it will redirect you to the sales uh, page of your course so right now I don't I didn't have edited my uh, pre-build uh, page uh, everything is by default there but I have only added my content uh, in two videos I have added two videos here so actually how I can share my uh, course link is this I will copy this URL except this one preview section and I will copy this one okay so this is the link that we can share with our students so that they can access this URL and they can log into their uh, this course uh, make sure that uh, don't include this preview equal to logout section so I will copy this so now this is the link that I can share with my students so that they can uh, they can enroll and they can sorry they can log in because I have already enrolled my students in this course if some someone have okay so this is the link that we can share with our students so let me just show you how we can use this link uh, I, I will suppose myself as a student and I will use this link to log in to this uh, course so that I can access the content okay so let me just show you so just open up your incognito window I'm opening up uh, but as if you are student you don't need to uh, open your incognito window because uh, in another uh, window I am uh, logged in as admin so that's why I need incognito window so I will paste that link URL link here I will click oh, enter so it will show me this okay so as you can see here now I am in uh, I am in incognito window I am not logged in as an admin I as uh, this page will be visible to ev everyone who will have this URL okay so if I am enrolled in this course by my admin and by my instructor so what I can do I can access this course by logging in by this little section or button you can say says login okay uh, this is the one mechanism that I can click on this login and I can provide the credentials that are shared by my admin or my instructor okay uh, the second thing is you can see here uh, all the content of my course is listed here so I can just click on start and it will prompt that uh, you need to log in first in order to access the content of the course so just wait my internet is a little slow so as you can see here 
it says lecture content block locked okay so I cannot access this uh, content of my uh, this lecture uh, as a student so what I need to do I need to log in okay so this is the second way so I will click on you will need to log in I will click on this and here these uh, credentials I have to use and these credentials will be provided by my instructor or by admin of uh, teacher okay so I have already uh, my credential so I will use okay I will use this email and I will use password which I have already set for this student okay and I will click on login button and I am redirected to my course so this is very easy like you must just have uh, one uh, you, okay, no, you, can, you can okay uh, you can log into your course easily so this is the one mechanism and now I have cancelled my incognito window uh, this is the first link that we can share with the student by the sales page and the second option is through course curriculum okay so just click on the course curriculum and it will redirect to this page and just uh, copy the URL instead uh, enrollment and I will copy this URL and you can also share this URL okay so I am copying this uh, URL and I will op open up my incognito window and paste here so when I hit enter button uh, it will also redirect me to the 1pv6 training courses so now I can see all the courses here uh, I am in incognito window I am not logged in as an admin or students but if I am already enrolled in any course by my instructor so I can pick up uh, that course like for example uh, I am enrolled I, I am already enrolled in the trend micro course so I will click on this course uh, and I will provide my credential to log in okay so it will redirect me to the uh, that same link which I have showed you earlier okay so what you need to do is you need to log in so I uh, know right that is this time I am going to click on this login and I will provide my credentials here so I will be logged in okay Okay, so this is the uh, these are two ways that we can uh, log into our uh, courses that are shared by our instructor or admin. Okay, I think uh, you get my point. Okay, thank you.